right, so what I got here is if if you're on a if you're gonna hang these clip-on dove decoys on a branch or on a this case a piece of wire, you want to go to a thick spot. All right, so if you clip on to this, you know it kind of gives a little bit. So if you have barbed wire or in, down here, if you have that woven wire, you want to clip onto the biggest piece possible. In this case, it's that barbed wire. So now it stays rock steady and it won't tilt on you. We got our mojo right there over an old garden spot from this year. It's been tilled under. I just picked an open spot right there that they can they can land. All right, so let me tell you a little bit about what we're doing right now. We got we're butted up to my horse pasture. The past week, I've been seeing probably about 80 doves flying over my house, landing and roosting oh, in sure. these trees over here. And uh, so I put the mojo and some decoys out there. I got some other decoys on this fence line. And hopefully that'll give them a nice uh, spot to land right before they come into roost. Maybe, you know, they're trying to get something else to eat, even though they've been eating all day. Hold on a second, bud. Um, they roost in these pine trees and these trees right here. There's a lake down there where they can stop by and get something to drink. Um, so I, I took some branches off the pine tree and I kind of put them into this woven wire fence to give me a blind on this backside because any of them coming this way, they're going to be right on top of me before um, they see me because it's a, just a tree canopy right here. But on this side, I was exposed, so I kind of made a makeshift blind. Like I said, just wove them in there. And now I'm, I'm sheltered, I'm covered from anything that way. And I can't really set up shooting that way because it's in the sunlight, wouldn't be good footage. And uh, I don't have my eclipse glasses. So I don't know how good it, I'd be shooting into the sun. So you never really want to set up shooting into the sun. These doves that I've, I've noticed been coming in about 7.30, we got about 20 minutes. And they should just be piling in here, here pretty soon. Weston, that's all I got my wife's 20 gauge um, out with me tonight. One, because it's semi-auto and it's a 20 gauge because we're so close to these doves. It's still before prime time right now. Helicopter's buzzing over the top of us, so we're gonna put our gun down. See it up there, bud? Look up. See it? Straight up. See that helicopter? Flying right over the top of us. Don't shoot. Because there's people in that helicopter. Did you see it? It's going bye bye. It's going bye bye. Alright, there's a bunch coming. On this side over here.
got him, didn't we? Can you help me put him in the bag? 